so everyone likes you more than they like me, so I figured we'd start the video off with you so I'd get all the likes. Okay. Right? Say everyone liked the video. Okay. Yeah, that's close enough. Hi. <laughs> Say hi guys. Hi guys. Say good morning. Oh my. Say my uncle's gonna be doing squats today. <laughs> Say he's doing squats. Daddy. Daddy. Roar. 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 So that being said, I am doing squats today. That is what is on the agenda. Squats, first time doing squats since I've been in Vegas, or even before I was in Vegas, I wasn't able to squat when I was in Vegas. And then I'm gonna be going to the beach with Jesse, and I was I thought it would be really cool to be able to show you guys, you know, the local beaches that I live next to because I am very lucky enough to live by many, many nice beaches. So that is on the that is on the agenda, that's what the plan is. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. So I just finished my leg day and I kind of wanted to do some commentary over my leg day just to kind of let you guys know what I do and why I do what I do. So on my leg day, the most important thing, in my mind at least, is that I want to be able to squat. So squatting is my, that's my most important thing, that's the thing that I'm focused on the most. So I try and make sure, obviously I do squats first. So that being said, how I feel about training is the thing that's most important to you should be the first thing that you're doing in your training. Like if, you, if you're concerned about gaining strength on your bench, if you're concerned about gaining strength on your squat like I am, I do that first. That's the first thing that I do. So that being said, today I wanted to do a five by five. Now this is my first time getting back into squats since I've been at the Olympia. And it was it was just weird. So it's been about a week since I've squatted, which is that's a long time for me. Normally I squat about twice a week. So I, I really wanted to work up to 255 pounds for five sets of five. That was my that was my most important thing that I, I went into this squat session thinking that's what I want to hit. So I went ahead and I was able to do that. So I was really, really excited about hitting two, 255 pounds for five sets of five. If you don't know what a five by five is, and people say like a five by five or a three by five, usually that means five sets of five reps or three sets of five reps. It's usually sets first and then reps after that. So I did the five by five with 255 pounds. Super duper, super, super stoked about that. Pause squats. Now I always do pause squats after I do regular squats. It's just I don't know. It's just something that I do. It feels really nice to be paused down in the hole. Now uh, for the pause squats, I ended up doing I think it was just I just did three sets of eight to ten reps um, with 205 pounds. So nothing super heavy. Um, it's kind of nice moving up because I, I I was doing 185 pounds for a really long time. Um, now I'm able to move up to 205 pounds, so that makes me happy. That's a 45 and a 35 pound plate on each side of the bar. And after that, I moved, and th this, that took a long time. That was about maybe an hour worth of working out. It took that long to do those, those sets. After that, I moved on to stiff-legged deadlifts. Basically, I just took the bar off of the rack, put it on the floor, and I did 205 pounds with that. I just did four sets of eight to 10 reps on that. And then after that, that so that was like, the majority of my workout. Now it doesn't sound like much, but I'm telling you, that's for me. That's like a that takes a long time. That's a lot of work. Like I'm sweating. I'm usually dying after that. So after that, I moved on to just like the easier stuff. At least that's what I call it, the easier stuff. I just did some quad extensions. I, I don't remember the weight, but I did. I did it to where I could only get about 12 reps out. Um, and then after that, I moved on to calf raises, and that was my whole leg day. Just a super. Super intense workout, nothing too crazy, but it, that's just what I've been doing for legs and it's really been working out and I've really been enjoying it and it's just been working out for me. So that's what I've been doing for legs. I really enjoy leg days. I love doing legs. If you don't like doing legs, I'm telling you, you're just doing it wrong. Make sure, and a lot of people don't like doing legs because they're kind of scared of squatting or they're scared They're scared of, it's squatting is scary. You guys have seen my videos on, on how I improve my squat. What I'd recommend to anybody, I have a whole video on how to get a better squat, how to improve your squat. Uh, I would recommend watching that, and there's tons of videos on YouTube on how you could you know, improve your squat and stuff like that. So I, I would go ahead and watch that because 
it's it's not fun going into a workout not looking forward to it. So I would recommend you know looking up how 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 can you improve your squat? How can you make it to where you are looking forward to squatting? So that's what I'd recommend. So I'm gonna get out of here. I'm super sweaty. You can't really tell in the video, but this shirt is drenched, and I need to take a shower, and then we're gonna go to the beach. All right, look who I'm with. Where are we going? La Playa. What's that? <laughs> I don't know what that means. It's the beach. In Spanish? In Spanish. I like it. What beach are we going to? Mission Beach. Why are we going there? Because that's the beach I picked. <laughs> that's the beach she picked. See, that's how this relationship works. So I have to go fill up my car and we're going to go to the beach. I'm excited to get some cool shots for you guys. I just, I really enjoy, um, Bring you guys along with me on my days because I don't know I just I just know that not everyone lives in such a beautiful city And I'm really lucky to live here So it's kind of fun just bringing you along to places that maybe you've never seen before and places that I don't see enough So let's go fill up my car now For a while it used to cost me 60 bucks to fill up $60 so Saving a little bit of money now it's still it's too expensive <laughs> That's, that's why you get a girlfriend, you guys, so she can carry you with your skateboard. And she just, you don't even have to push. Use girlfriend power. Girlfriend power! <laughs> so we're just here hanging out at uh, Belmont Park. You don't, you don't want to look at the camera? No. Are you embarrassed of what you're eating right now? No. Can you explain to them what you got? I got a... You got a Lunchable. Turkey and cheddar Lunchable. That's what I got. She decided to get a turkey cheddar. I didn't go, I didn't get much better. I ended up getting, if you guys have ever had mangoes with chili on it, these things are really good. I've only eaten oats this morning. That's all I've had all day today, and it's already about to be 6.30 right now. So, I think it's okay if I eat this. How are, how are your Lunchables? Very good. Are they good? Very good. I'm in third grade again. Huh? I'm in third grade again. I know, yeah, pretty much. Okay, update on the mangoes. They're a lot spicier than I remembered. <laughs> My tongue is on fire. 